Look, uh, patient safety and our, our staff safety are top priority. Yeah. Uh, thank God. I think the person of those in the rally were very orderly. Yeah. Nothing was damaged in the hospital. I think they also repeat uh, the world. Uh, so uh, I want to thank all of my media for the concern of our hospital. It, uh, I think just now, uh, I think it's time. Is there any damage? I should pay. But I think, thank you very much for the call. Actually, there is no damage. So, uh, this is uh, what I'm going to say. Do any patients affect me? No, no. Is there any damage? No, 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 no damage. There was no damage. Is there any window broken? No, no, no. Nothing damaged. I think uh, what what is severely damaged is the rule of law. <laughs> I think that is the one that is most severely damaged. As mentioned just now by many of the victims here who sought refuge. I mean, first, uh, they came here today to say thank you. To say a very simple thank you to Tongshin Hospital for being human. Because yesterday, we see so many acts of cruelty by inhumane policemen, which I'm sure is only represents a small proportion of of the uh, good policemen in the country. You want to say thank you to the machine for being to remain and offering shelter without chasing out those who needed help yesterday. I think this is why we come here today. Secondly, we want to also stress a very important principle that the police is wrong. Number one, uh, as Thomas mentioned just now, you talk about international convention of warfare, you, are, you should not target hospitals. Even in war, a hospital should not be targeted. This is not war. Malaysia is not at war. How can you shoot into a hospital compound? Imagine, luckily there were no, as I said, uh, tragic consequences, but imagine, if there were tragic consequences, how can the police bear that type of responsibility? So this is something that we, uh, we want to condemn. Just as uh, we uh, express uh, great anger at the, uh, uh, the death of, uh, of one of those who participated in the peaceful gathering and who died, uh, we are fortunate that nothing happened in Tongshin. So, we, as I said once again, I want to thank uh, the hospital. We want to condemn police for firing gas canisters into the hospital compound. It, it should not be allowed and it cannot be accepted, this type of practice. And the DAB urges the Home Minister if he still wants to believe in the rule of law, the action should be taken against police officers who fired rounds of tear gas and also sprayed the water cannon into the hospital compound. I repeat again, even under the International Convention of Warfare by the United Nations, you cannot target hospitals and ambulances. And Malaysia is not at war. So how can the police do that? This is unacceptable. This is not the work of a police. So I think we want to stress uh, these two points. One, we thank the hospitals. And number two, I think we must make a very, very strong statement. The police cannot do so. They should apologize to the Tongshin Hospital for firing uh, tear gas in the hospital and uh, action must be taken against those that are responsible and this must not be allowed to happen again. <coughs>